My brother Steve is, we tease him that he bleeds black and red, closest to Steve Menace of anybody I know. He bleeds black and red. Like my dad is the epitome of Benedictine. You know, he, he's very gracious. He's one, the most generous man I know. He always says that God has allowed him to have so much so that he can help others and give it away. I don't know of anyone who would be more deserving than my brother Steve. He is committed to Benedictine. He's committed not only to Benedictine, but he also commits his classmates to Benedictine, and he builds a spirit, the Benedictine spirit. He is so kind, loving, generous, caring, and just includes me in everything, whether I want to be included or not. <laughs> he is just a great guy. He is all about family and commitment and um, finding ways to keep others connected. Steve is he's very genuine and his easygoing nature just makes him so approachable. And when he gives advice, um, it's in such a way that you know he could tell you so much more, but he just has a way about him that you want to know more and you just start valuing his opinion and uh, his perspective on things, um, I mean, it's tremendous because it's influenced first of all by his faith and his family and that really comes across. Whatever he's doing, he's gonna be passionate about it. Giving his complete self to whatever endeavor that may, whether that's his class, his family, um, an organization he's involved in. And that's really kind of the vision of, of St. Benedict is giving yourself completely to whatever uh, God is asking of you. This last year when Archbishop Nauman founded the new parish, St. John Paul II, uh, Steve and Peggy are our founding members. So they're part of the group that decided, you know, they wanted to be part of this incredible process of developing a parish in a new area. And uh, they've been invaluable. You know, Steve is one I can count on for great consultation. He has tremendous experience in the church. Oh, I absolutely think my dad deserves this. You know, he put so much of himself into what he does, and it truly is because of Benedictine. You know, he talks about the friends that he made for a lifetime when he was at college. It, it just doesn't surprise me. Like, my dad is so generous and just the man they call for everything. So it wasn't a surprise to me when they said, when he told me that, hey, I'm getting the Kansas Monk Award. 